Santa knows where to find all the best and hottest smartphones just in time to make this Christmas better and bigger than ever. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless. Ho, 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 ho. The Appalachian Artisan Center's Culture of Recovery Project was recently chosen to receive $475,000 in funding from Art Place America's 2017 National Creative Placemaking Fund. The center is taking a novel approach to combat Eastern Kentucky's addiction crisis by partnering with Hickory Hill Recovery Center, Knott County Drug Court, and Eastern Kentucky Certified Employment Program to offer art and entrepreneurial workshops to participants with substance use disorders. The initiative seeks to provide holistic recovery through the arts. Our guys will be going down there to participate in some of the woodworking and the pottery and the luthery, hopefully, and uh, some of the other programs that they offer. And uh, I think basically it's just uh, a really good thing for our guys to get involved with, uh, just for them to have something uh, to be involved with and to uh, you know, start something and finish it and see it all the way through. And uh, I think it's really just a great thing to go along with them uh, in their recovery process. Officials with the Appalachian Artisan Center say the work they'll be doing is some of the most important work they could do. In a way, this is a small thing that we're doing, taking programs that we already offer to people in recovery. But on the other hand, offering support to individuals at such a crucial time in their lives is maybe the most important thing we could be doing. For more information on the Appalachian Artisan Center's Culture of Recovery Project, visit them at the web address listed on your screen. Reporting from Hindman, I'm Sean Allen for EKB News.